Hello everyone and welcome to this video where I'm discussing the end of the strike of 35,000 Public Service Alliance of Canada PSAC, employees from the Canada Revenue Agency CRA, and the tentative agreement that was announced. As you may know, the strike took place shortly after the tax filing deadline and had the potential to disrupt CRA operations and services. So many Canadians were celebrating when it led up the recently negotiated deal. However, the deal was met with a lot of criticism from some members of the PSAC subgroup, like the Union of Taxation Employees. They argued that the deal was not fair, despite the tentative agreement including wage increases totaling 12.6% over four years, and an additional one-time lump sum payment of $2,500 that represented an additional 3.6% of salary for the average member. The disagreement between PSAC and some members of the subgroup follows other heated labor disputes within the public service, including one with members of the government itself. This time, they had gotten in a dispute with over 120,000 workers that was eventually settled with a 11.5% wage increase over four years. Although the two sides ultimately came to an agreement, it was a hard-fought negotiation. Even as recently as Wednesday, the union threatened to disrupt a convention that was scheduled to be held by the Liberal Party in Ottawa if the government didn't table a fair agreement. The tentative agreement is awaiting a final vote, and it is unclear whether the members of the subgroup will accept it. If not, then both parties will have to go back to the bargaining table. It's been an eventful week for many bargaining units, and the conclusion of this agreement will surely be followed closely by many. Thank you for watching and be sure to stay updated with us for further developments in this story.